Hey, this is Mike. Fresh off the truck, couldn't wait to get it cleaned up. Had to do a video as soon as possible before this thing sells. 2014 Dodge Challenger Header Orange Shaker RT. Awesome looking vehicle. It's got the shaker here in the front. It's got the stripes on the top and on the hood. Awesome looking vehicle. One of the features is that it has remote start. So I'm going to go ahead and start it up so we can see that shaker shake. And it does have a proximity key where you can walk up and open up the handle there. See it's locked now. Key's in my pocket. I just walk up, touch the handle, unlocks. I can relock it by pushing this button. Check out these wheels. Nice big alloy wheels. 20 inch. It's got Goodyear Eagle F1s. There's the tire size. And like I said, it's dirty because it was on the truck and hasn't been cleaned up yet but I just want to do a video before it sells because it probably will sell fast it does have the backup sensors back here dual exhaust now to me this is a modern day muscle car I mean it's hard to say that on most cars. Some of them try to have that muscle look. This one I think achieves it. I'm just noticing, looks like it has some interesting exhaust, com I mean, uh, suspension components in there. I'm gonna put the camera down here, maybe you can see what I'm not seeing. All right. Here's the trunk. Got plenty of trunk space. A lot more than I thought. This lifts up. There's where your battery is. Pretty good size battery. Spare tire. The color really, to me, makes a big difference on this. The wheels, the tires, you can tell they're just high performance tires. The color, the shaker. Before we go on the inside, I want to just go ahead and pop the hood. Usually I do that last, but let's go ahead and do that now. Automatic start. Remote start will turn, the vehicle will turn off if the hood's popped. That's why it turned off. But I'm going to turn it back on here in a second. Check it out. It has, check out that hood. It says shaker right there. It says shaker there on the shaker. You got a uh, high performance intake. Uh, uh, air filter. I guess the air comes in here. Through there and through this. But it's cool that when you lift the hood, you can see this kind of exposed. You can check it out. You can actually see some metal there. A lot of engines nowadays, you don't see too much plastic for me. It's a little windy. Hopefully it won't interfere with the camera too much. Let me go ahead and start it back up. 
because that's part of the fun. go inside. I want to show you the view of that cool shaker from the, the cockpit here. All right. Inside here, we've got a pretty cool sporty looking steering wheel. It's got your grips here. It's flat on the bottom, so sort of like SRT steering wheel, I believe. But on the steering wheel, you got your cruise control. You've got paddle shifters here on the back. You have volume control on the back of the steering wheel for the radio. And a change of stations on this side, on the back of the steering wheel. I'll turn that radio down. And, okay, where do I want to start? Okay, here's your, um, you compare your phone. It does have Bluetooth, so we're going to answer the phone while you're cruising along. Uh, voice recognition does have that. Now, here, here's, here's your gauges. You can see they're white, have like a classic sporty look to them. This vehicle has 12 miles. But right there where it says, you see the S and the 69, <laughs> that's a, uh, the direction the vehicle is facing south 69 degrees outside and below that you can see it tells you what radio station you're on now you can push this menu button here I'm going to go ahead and push it so you can get different information you have digital ooh 0 to 60 time that's pretty cool and it's ready <laughs> let's see if I can do a test drive video on this stay tuned and Keep an eye on my channel. I might try to do a test drive video on that one. That's pretty cool. Vehicle speed. So anytime I, I want to go back to the compass, I can just push this menu button um, right there and just keep pushing it until it comes back there. You can open the trunk here. It does have automatic headlights. you got your power windows, door locks, side mirror controls. And it's got like a kind of orangey stitching going on with the everything it's kind of gold I guess you could say I mean there's where it says shaker the seats are awesome They're just kind of that muscle car look from the 70s 60s and 70s here's your radio it does have navigation it has satellite radio um, you can load a CD or a DVD in here and put files onto a hard drive, which it has. You can also use this USB port to add files to the hard drive. And, um, you know, there's a lot of cool stuff there. there. It does have automatic climate control. It's set on automatic right now. I bet you the air conditioner is probably interfering with the camera, but oh well. It does have sport mode and uh, heated seats here in the front there's a pocket there power supply there there's your shifter put it out and drive like that and you can use the pad paddle shifters to change gears if you wanted to or you can bump it left and right hold it to the right and it goes back in the drive there's your cup holders place to put your cell phone Armrest lifts up. You got some storage pocket here. It has a power supply, 12 volt, and also has a USB port for plugging in your phone or whatever. Place to put some coins. There's a good compartmentalized com glove compartment. Shaker number 0637. Now, this is a shakers are a limited edition. I'm not exactly sure how many there is. 
uh, made but they're limited it's not like you can you know once they're sold out they're sold out so that's something to consider there's the rear view mirror some lights right here I don't know if you can see that it's for your garage door controls place to put your sunglasses if they can fit in there it's kind of looks kind of small to me but maybe it's just the way it looks visors have mirrors and lights as well as a little extender there same thing on that side back seats look awesome And in my excitement, I probably missed over about a thousand things. Let's look at the window sticker. 2014 Dodge Char Ch Challenger RT Shaker. Twenty-five miles per gallon on the highway. Not bad for a muscle car. Pretty good safety ratings. All right, there it is, and I'm gonna see if I can do some uh, driving on the road test drive videos. But um, that's up to the manager. So this isn't my car, so I have to do what he says. But anyway. There it is. If you have any questions, if you'd like me to see, if I still have it and you want me to send you some detailed pictures on a particular thing, my email address is in the description. I have a phone number in there as well. So let me know. Thanks for watching. See you next time.